Hey everybody, I just finished the engine swap on my 1968 Firebird, so I figured I'd do a quick video and show everything that I've done. And also one thing that I just added is the classic plates. I picked those up at a flea market not too long ago and the number wasn't registered, so I took them to the, the tax office and got them registered. Uh... Anyway, it's a 68 Firebird. Uh, I swapped the 400 out of it and put in a Chevy 350 board 020 over. It's got Edelbrock aluminum heads, Edelbrock RPM air gap intake. Uh, it's got the billet aluminum rocker arms, a Summit Racing cam in it with 0.465 lift. Uh, it's 10 to 1 compression and I got the ceramic coated headers MSD distributor and wires and got the aluminum radiator which I still got to connect the top hose but it has been running and with the electric fan and the with the billet aluminum uh, pulleys you know everything on here is new uh, custom fabricated aluminum valve covers as well and uh, had to pick up some new hood hinges too the other ones were just falling apart uh, see I got some really good motor mounts in there the pro form I highly recommend them they are very 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 good motor mounts and they keep you know inch and squeak and rattle to the minimum and uh just some old stuff that i've done with the grand steering wheel and probably one of my favorite parts is i redid all the gauges and put a carbon fiber cluster in there and they're marshall gauges out of california anaheim anaheim california and they work great and everything works and i got my b and m shifter uh it's not the uh a ratchet shifter I thought about doing one of those but then uh, I just kind of shied away from it but uh they also added on the little ducktail back there the spoiler and uh yeah the engine swap went great I'm, I'm really happy with the motor uh, I would start it up for y'all but uh as you can see I still have to get my exhaust system hooked up. It's open headers right now. And I already know some of my neighbors don't appreciate that. So I've been not able to drive it that much. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe for more videos of this car. I'll put up a dyno video soon and uh, stuff like that. Thanks a lot.